out of the trees and they start falling more. Yeah, so they get yeah, the yeah. Just Makes a couple sense. more weeks. Yep. Yeah, we'll, we'll get there. there. All right, Stefano, thanks. Well, summer is ending soon, but there are some fun local traditions that come with the end of the season. One of those traditions is La Festa Italiana, and Eyewitness News reporter Christina Schalhoop is live in Old Forge this morning with a preview. Good morning, Christina. Good morning. We are at Arcaro and Janelle's. I have had the time of my life this morning preparing for La Festa Italiana. Chris, for anyone looking to come out, what can they see at La Festa this week? Oh, lots of food and entertainment. Entertainment on three different stages. Free, come right down, over 50 acts. We have the Pizza Boys, great kids coming from New Jersey. Flipping dough, it's going to be a ball. That's so cool, and it's going to be fun for everyone. It's a family environment, right? Family environment, uh, again, a lot of entertainment. We have the James R. Minicosi Memorial Run on Saturday morning, so if you want to walk and or run, you know, it all benefits the Boys and Girls Club of NEPA. Awesome, and of course, the food. Oh, my God. God, three places. Give me three I gotta go to. Well, we're fortunate. We're in the pizza capital of the world right now as we're putting up tents in downtown Scranton. This is uh, this is Old Forge, and we have Cusimanos, Ravellos, and our great friends here at our Carol and Janelle's. You can't beat the pizza. And you know what? We are here, of course, at our Carol and Janelle's. Tell me a little more about the restaurant, what people can enjoy at the festival, too. Okay, we've been going to the festival for over 25 years. We have our tray of red, double crust white, homemade gnocchis of meatballs, cannolis, we also have sausage and peppers, eggplant rollantini, tripe, cavatelli and broccoli. And more. And, <laughs> and you can also get these item in, items located in our takeaway kitchen too. Awesome. I have to tell you, I'm starving listening to that. Speaking of which, I don't know, I might just like sneak over here, grab myself a cannoli. I mean, come on guys. I had to do it at some point, right? Oh my God. And it's really good. I'm going to eat this, guys. How about you take it away while I finish this cannoli? Sound good? Mm. All right, music, food, and fun all at La Festa starting on Friday. Plenty to go check out. And by the way, Stefano, if you're listening to this, I will bring you back a cannoli, I promise. We hope she brings us all that cannoli. I know. Why just Stefano? I know. Come on. It we all the like... Italian one, but we want it too. You know, I had my first cannoli last week mm -hmm. ever. Really? It was really good. Yeah, they're amazing. I can't think of it as cheese, though. I have to think it's like some dessert filling. Because if oh, I think well. of it as cheese, I'm like, that's a lot of cheese in there. Yeah, that's but a good point. Well, it's a lot really of sugar, good. too. Yeah, there's, there's also that. Really Very good stuff. Good. We'll be right back with the final check of our top stories here.